In the world of professional soccer, there are thousands of clubs. They all want to win trophies, but only a handful have any influence after the final whistle blows and the players all go home. Poet Tel Aviv is much more than just a football club. In the complex reality of the Middle East, Apoel is a unique community which accepts and embraces people no matter their color, religion or nationality. Uh, it's no wonder Apoel has players from all religions, all sectors, and this is something we're really proud of. Hapoel, Hebrew for the working class, was founded in 1927 in Tel Aviv as a leading Labour Party soccer club. It didn't take long before Hapoel became the symbol of the new Israel, attracting support from poets, soldiers, academic leaders, and people from all over the country. This special mix of Israelis all found a home in the old stadium at Jaffa. Israel's cultural, social, and financial hub is the city of Tel Aviv. The young and vibrant city has been given the nickname the non-stop city. And like in every big city, soccer plays a major part of life there. Hapoel Tel Aviv is one of the two most successful clubs in Israel's history. Rivaled only by its neighbor, Maccabi Tel Aviv. The matches between the two local rivals are eagerly awaited by all sports fans in Israel. For Hapoel, local achievements just whet the appetite to succeed on the world stage. In 2002, Hapoel reached the quarterfinals of the UEFA Cup, beating teams such as Parma, AC Milan and Chelsea. the game in Israel, we went to Stanford Bridge just to say thank you for a great European season. And then we scored the first goal. It was, everyone started cheering and singing. It was amazing, it was like this beating red heart in a deep blue sea. It was unbelievable. You know, we beat Chelsea. The final whistle blows. Hapoel wins! Unbelievable! Hapoel Tel Aviv beats Chelsea in UEFA Cup. In addition, Hapoel made an historic appearance in the Champions League in 2010. Let's go on. The next one is Hapoel Tel Aviv from Israel. Hapoel's success in European competitions has made them a household name among soccer fans across the continent. What a goal by Zahabi! What an amazing goal! However, what really drives this unique club is its loyal throng of fans. A comprehensive academic study found that Hapoel is more defined by its fans than any other team in Israel. The Red fans are known for their devotion. It starts with unprecedented loyalty and ends with blind love. No game is too far away. No mission is too hard. Every fan feels a part of a family, and every family member feels a part of Hapoel, as mothers, fathers, and their children come together to support their team. People from all sections of Israeli society, Jews and Muslims, Orthodox and secular, political leaders and laborers can be found at Bloomfield on a match day afternoon. أول شيء أنا بفكر إنه نجاح الفريق أبويل تل أبيف هذا أهم من كل شيء تاني البويل تل أبيف دائما كانت عائلة واحدة كبيرة للكل ودائما لما في لعيب عربي اللي هو الكابتن وهو ناجح بالفريق هذا بيرفع راس كل العرب مش بس هذا البويل تل أبيف. This example extends beyond the grass. Hapoel are deeply involved in educational projects that touch tens of thousands of children in Israel, the Palestinian territories, and throughout the world who now, thanks to soccer, have a real opportunity for a better future. The club behind this worthy initiative and the winner of the Beyond Sport Award for Sport Team of the Year is Hapoel Tel Aviv.
The story of Hapoel Tel Aviv is intertwined with the story of Israeli society. While meeting the challenges of the modern world, the club respects its traditions and maintains a legacy of values and ties with its supporters that only grows stronger with time. הדבר שהכי עושה לי את זה, זה שלושה דורות מהמשפחה שלי באים יחד למשחק של הפועל. My father introduced me when I was four years old to Apoel. Now I'm sitting with my grandchild. Four generation of supporter. That's in fact Apoel. That's the essence of Apoel and that's the spirit. With adequate resources and the right leadership, Hapoel will continue to attain success as a team, as a club, and for Israeli society as a whole.